Well, Thick Bush carries on. However, we have managed to keep up with her. And she is walking what it seems straight into Treehouse Dam. So I'm hoping she's going to go there for a drink because we are pretty much in the middle of the block away from any possible road. So she's steadily headed in that direction. So we're going to try and keep up with her as she does and as she disappears in the bushes. She's definitely up to something and I find it interesting that she didn't drink at Twin Dams or that she's carried on moving in this particular path because this area Shadow has been using it a lot when she crosses back from either Huffman's or Little Gowry and then she comes back into into Vuyatela. So I wonder if perhaps Tandi's not picked up the sense of, of Shadow from a few days ago although with the rain that would be quite hard. But hmm, let's just carry on following and see what she's up to this morning. Now she has dragged us through some very thick bushes, so I'm hoping she carries on going like this because then we'll go back to an area that's a little bit easier for us to follow her. Oh, there she is standing. I just... So I can't go closer to her because unfortunately where she's walking is very thick and lots of branches and stumps, so we're trying to keep her in sight. Jody, you're wondering how long can a leopard go without water? Well, we normally... Eh, we. The leopards have to drink daily and we see them drinking but they can only drink once a day or if they have to they can survive with drinking just once a day and then they'll <laughs> drink for quite a long while and then carry on sometimes if the water is not available perhaps you'll see that they'll be capable of going without water for maybe two days or so but they have to drink they're not like some of the antelope species that get all the moisture from everything that they eat so that they can go sometimes even a week without eating Now, there's clearly something there that got her attention. I wonder what it is. Where are you going to go? Are you carry on towards Treehouse Dam? That would be much appreciated on our side. Now, mm, let me just... She carried on moving. I can't really see her anymore, so I'm gonna try going around this termite mound just to make sure that she's carried on walking. Ah, there she is again. Okay, so she has carried on in the same direction. So I'm gonna try and go around this termite mound that's here on our right hand side and then get to her again once more. Okay, she's in front of us. She seems to be stalking. Like all of her posture, the way her tail's flicking. There we go. Hello, Tandy. Where are you going? Where are you going to head off? All right, don't don't go in that direction too much. Carry on going north. We would like you very much to go into Treehouse Dam so that we can have a beautiful look of you. All right, I think we're gonna start heading into a bit of a thicker area as well because now she's completely disappeared for us in the bushes and I can't see her anymore. So I just wanna keep up with her just in case she changes direction. Nope, she hasn't changed direction. I can see her going into another termite mount. <laughs> Wonderful. I must say, it's very obliging of her and her son to always go on top of termite mounts. There we go, she's in front of us. So I'm gonna stop here just to give her enough space. <laughs> We've been attacked by all sorts of branches with the roof. It's a lot easier driving around without it, but I think so far we can't really complain as we've been lucky. Now she's on top of the termite mount, tail constantly flicking. So she is probably stalking looking for food, which means that you see, even with the full belly, she's still up to something. I haven't been able to see any prey species around. She's uh, still moving north, we're getting closer to the, to the dam itself. Oh, 
So you're wondering how we can distinguish if she's got a full tummy or if she's pregnant. Well, she could be pregnant, but uh, because she was mating with a male leopard a few a few weeks ago. However, we also know that she stole somebody else's kill yesterday because they saw her do it. So I think this full belly is likely a food baby rather than an actual an actual baby. She's just gone static on a mound now. Maybe I think you should be able to get my audio from the dam itself. Hmm, where am I gonna go now? Just directly south from the dam. Hello girl. Now, what are you looking at in the distance? We are not too far from the dam and there's somebody that would like to come and have a look so I'm going to be on the radio on and I'm just trying to direct them in here. Hmm. Tandy, what a long day it's been for you. You've been missioning. Uh, it's always quite something to see her or to see any sort of leopard on top of a termite mound. And I do know that there is this odd branch in the way, but if I go around her, I'm going to disturb her quite a bit. So I would prefer not doing that, because I don't think she's going to s lay here for too long. More likely than not, she's going to carry on moving. So I'm just going <laughs> to give her some time to settle and probably rest, because she's been walking quite a bit. Hmm. Seems like I've got to direct somebody else, or try to direct somebody else into this very thick block. So while I do that, let's go over to Steph, who's found something on the ground. 